want to nuke over 300 million Americans and start World War III. It's simple as that. It's simple as that. This is not about me. This is not about David Taylor, my belts, my suits, my jackets, none of that about how I'm, I'm handling money because I'm not doing anything wrong with money and all of these other things. It is the devil trying to distract the American public to create a barrage against my character so they do not have to listen to the voice of God. But you've got to understand, and I, I say this very humbly, if you do not hear Jesus, the last time Jesus came to me in 2005, he said to me, if they will not hear you, you are the last messenger I'm sending before the war. And he says, you are the only messenger I am sending with the solution. Because there's been a lot of prophets who has prophesied this, who've seen the dreams. Uh, they've had visitations from angels. Some of them are dead now that I used to work with and work around. Uh, that came from Romania and other countries uh, who the archangel Gabriel appeared to them in dreams and told them uh, about the coming war like Demetrius Duneman. I was with those guys during that time. I, they, we were together because they know I was prophesying the same thing without even knowing them. So God has raised up many prophets from around the world who uh, at one time, I think Demetrius is dead right now. He's dead. And I think they're showing him in the background. He's dead now. But uh, I used to go around, uh, you know, the world and then where basically America with a whole group that was just, we knew the prophecy that God was saying to America. And I'm really left as one of the only ones talking about this thing concerning America's, uh, 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 I mean, this prophecy to America. A lot of pastors and leaders do not want to make their ministry or even get close to touch this subject because they don't want to seem like a doom and gloom prophet or um, a doom and gloom pastor because we live in such a, um, a, a microwave, uh, um, what do they call it, um, this user-friendly uh, type of church stuff that got going on today. Uh, they don't want to say anything controversial, but that's the problem. It, it, that's just really the problem right there, that if we do not talk up and speak up about what's happening, something very devastating is coming. Something very bad is coming to this nation, but we can turn that around. Amen? Amen.